everyone and welcome back to my channel so if you want to see how i created this look which was using all of nyx makeup then carry on watching this is a one brand tutorial and i really hope you like it comment below what you want to see next on my channel and i'd love to know so if you want to see how i created this look then keep on watching the foundation i'm going to start with is the nyx stay matte but not flat foundation and i love this foundation so much it's a little bit pale for me at the moment but i think it will still work and this is a really good definitely full coverage foundation i think and i just really like it and i'm gonna dot that all over my face and buff it in the brush i'm going to use to buff this in is the real technique stippling brush because i really like this brush just for all over buffing in foundation So that is the foundation, I really like this foundation because it's got a really nice buildable coverage but if you want a light coverage that's what I've gone for today and for summer I think that's perfect. Next up I'm going to set with the NYX HD Studio Photogenic Powder and I love this for just a light finish. And I'm going to use this little technique to brush this. I tried baking with this once and it literally stuck on my face. Dust it and it makes it so matte. Next up, I'm going to move on to eyes because eyes is one of my favourite things to do, and NYX do amazing eye stuff. And I've got a few things here to show you. I've got the NYX Love in Florence palette, which is in Bellini Kit, and it's this really nice shimmery colours and I love that for more of a glittery look. Next palette I have is the Love in Paris one and this is in Genesis Quay. It's this one and I use this a lot throughout winter and I got this at the Beauty Blogger Awards. And the next one I got which was recently when NYX came into Boots and this is the Gold Lust Individual Eyeshadow and this is this one. I'm going to use this one today. So I'm actually going to use a combination of all three palettes and I'm going to start off with the Love in Paris one and I'm going to use this brown shade first. It's all so pigmented and I'd really recommend them. So just applying this brown shade in the crease. have got the transition shade I'm going to go straight ahead with this individual eyeshadow in gold lust and this is a super pretty colour and I'm just going to swatch it first oh my god that is insanely pigmented it's so nice and I'm going to apply this with a paddle brush Now I've actually applied Gold Lust all over the lid but I'm going to again go back in with this brown shade which actually I've just had a look and these shades don't have names but I think it's, wow, this is shade number 6. I apply again some of it just to blend out the gold colour. going to apply just a small amount of black into the crease just to make it a little bit more smoky. Using a smaller brush and applying this black shade here. And using a fluffier brush to blend this out. Next up is eyebrows and I think eyebrows is one of the things that NYX is so good for. Next up I'm going to use one of my favourite things which is the NYX contour kit. As you can see I've emptied two of these pans which was the two lighter shades which is the banana shade and the white shade but I still have all the contour shades and the highlights left which is what I'm going to use today. So using the shade, I'm going to use this one which is Nectar. And I'm going to contour my cheekbones using a Rotate contour brush. Oh, 
and I'm going to contour the temples of my forehead as well. Now I'm going to take a duo fibre brush and this shade which is a bit more orangey and I'm going to bronze. Just a small amount. Now using blush I'm going to use the NYX blush in Boudoir and this is a really dark pink and looks like this one here and this is a really dark pink and I'm gonna blush my cheeks I'm gonna go onto my cheeks and highlight and I'm gonna use a mix of these two shades I'm then just going to take a giant duo fibre brush and blend it all together. Next up I have one of the NYX Liquid Suede Liquid Lipsticks to show you and this is in the shade Sandstorm and it's such a nice colour here and it's so nice and I also have a bright pink one of these but I thought I'd use this one as this was more of a bronzy look. Such a nice colour. This is such a nice colour, I've just got to wait for it to set because it does go matte. This is the finished look, I really hope you liked it, um, I really enjoyed using the products, especially this eyeshadow and the liquid lipstick, um, I went for something not very neutral and you could wear it for night and you could wear it for daytime but I really hope you liked it, you can buy NYX in Boots and Boots.com, just look at their Instagram which is NYX UK Cosmetics and you will find out what stores they are heading to next. I love the look the liquid lipstick gave and I'm going to be doing a giveaway soon where I'm going to be giving away one NYX liquid lipstick so make sure you look at my Instagram which is Ghost Blondie to check that out. I really hope you enjoyed this look and, and comment below what you loved about this tutorial and what product you loved the best from NYX. Comment also below what videos you'd like to see next because I'd love to know what you guys want to see and thank you. Please comment, like and subscribe. And